How to fix an ink cartridge not recognized by printer. Today, we'll be showing you how to fix cartridges not being recognized by your printer. This video will give you step-by-step -step instructions on what to do when your printer is unable to detect a new ink cartridge. Why is my printer not recognizing ink? Cartridges have microchips that come in contact with the printer upon installation. The printer then tracks the number of pages that have been printed through the cartridge chip. Installing a new cartridge resets your printer's memory. Your printer should be able to detect that the new cartridge still has 100% printing capacity. Reasons why your new ink cartridge isn't working properly can be due to the following. Expired cartridges. Firmware has been updated. ROM cartridge model installed. The protective tape was not removed. Incorrect position of color slot of installed cartridges. The contacts in your printer or cartridge are damaged or dirty. The printer's memory has not yet reset and is still reading the data from the previous chip. The new ink cartridge was stored improperly, causing the cartridge's ink and its metal contacts to dry out. If your printer is unable to read or recognize the new ink cartridge, a red or amber light will be illuminated, indicating that there's an issue. You may also see a cartridge error message on your printer's LCD screen or on the status monitor. The cartridge error messages are quite similar regardless of the printer brand. You may encounter the following error messages. Low ink, cartridge problem, one or more cartridges appear to be damaged, remove them and replace them with new cartridges. The protective tape was not removed. Ink cartridge failure, printer cartridges missing or not detected. Toner is not compatible, no cartridge installed. These are just a few examples of what you will see on your printer's LCD screen due to a cartridge error. Now that we have a better understanding of why your printer does not recognize the new cartridge and what error messages we might encounter, let's get started. We'll be showing you two simple tips for fixing cartridges not recognized by your printer. Before we get started with these troubleshooting steps, you must first check for the following. Ensure that you are using the right cartridge for your printer. Check the expiration date on the cartridge. The bright protective tape of the cartridge has been removed. Make sure that the cartridge is in the correct color slot. Check to see if the cartridge chip is facing the printer's contacts. If everything is in place, it's time to begin with our first tip. Tip 1. Resetting the printer's memory. There are two ways to reset your printer's memory. Let's begin with the first one. It's possible your printer's memory is still detecting data from the previous used ink cartridge. To fix this problem, reinstall the used ink cartridge. Step 1. Uninstall the new ink cartridge. To avoid ink leaks, place the cartridge on a flat surface with a paper towel underneath. Step 2. Reinstall the previously used ink cartridge into your printer. Step 3. Give the printer a few minutes to recognize the old cartridge. Step 4. Now, remove the used cartridge and replace it with the new one. Step 5. Check if your printer is now recognizing the new cartridge. If it does, you're all set to go. If it's still not working, let's try unplugging the printer to clear its memory. This is the second method of resetting your printer's memory. Let's begin. Step 1. Remove the new cartridge from the printer. Again, to avoid ink leaks, place the cartridge on a flat surface with a paper towel underneath. Step 2. Turn off the printer. Step 3. Unplug the machine and remove the power cord to clear the printer's memory. Step 4. Wait for at least 10 minutes before plugging the printer in again. Step 5. After the waiting period, plug in your printer but do not turn it on. Now, go ahead and reinstall the new cartridge. Step 6. Once the new cartridge is in place, turn on your printer. If your printer is recognizing the new cartridge, you're all done and ready to print. Tip 2. Cleaning the metal contacts of the printer and ink cartridges. Another reason for ink cartridge failure is your cartridge chips or printer metal contacts might be dirty. It's easy to resolve this problem by using a lint-free cloth and rubbing alcohol. Step 1. Take out the new cartridges from the printer and place them on a flat surface with a paper towel underneath. Step 2. Turn the printer off and unplug it from its power source, whether that be the wall or a power strip. Step 3. Locate the metal contacts of the cartridge. Step 4. Grab your lint-free cloth and lightly dab it into some rubbing alcohol. 
Wipe the surface of the cartridge contacts gently. Be careful to not damage or leave residue on the contacts. Step 5. Locate the printer's metal contacts. Wipe it gently with the lint-free cloth lightly dipped in rubbing alcohol. Again, be careful not to damage or leave residue on the printer's contacts. Step 6. Reinstall the new cartridges into the printer. Step 7. Now, plug in the printer and turn it on. Step 8. Print a test page to see if your cartridge issue is fixed. If cleaning your printer and cartridge contacts do not work, it's time to test if the cartridge or the printer is damaged by using other printer inks. Your cartridge or printer might have electrical damage that's not clearly visible. Try installing another new cartridge. Replacing the cartridges with a whole new set can sometimes be the solution to your problem. If the issue remains, call a printer technician as a problem might be your printer itself. We hope we're able to help you with our video. To avoid the problem of a new printer cartridge not working in the future, remember the following tips. Store your cartridges in a clean, cool, dry place. Check your printer and cartridges often for any leakage. Make sure your printer is not exposed to dust or dirt. Avoid updating the printer firmware by turning off or disabling your printer's update feature. If your printer has been recently updated, check the links in the description below for the step-by-step -step guide on how to downgrade or disable your printer's firmware feature for selected HP and Epson printers. We'd love to hear your feedback. Feel free to leave comments or questions below. For more helpful printing tips, please leave us a like, hit that notification bell, and subscribe to our channel.